Hey, what's up guys? Phoenix here, and this video is a live stream highlight from a live stream that happened previously a couple of nights ago. If you're interested in catching the live streams when they happen, then definitely go check out the link to my Twitch channel in the description down below, and hit that little follow notification to be notified when I go live next time, so you can join in on the crazy things that I do during my live streams. But other than that, enjoy the video, enjoy the little highlight, and let me know what you think in the comments down below. I'll see you in the next one, guys. I need to play a different deck. How about Ritual Beasts? Um, this is not my most recent list. There's very clearly a max C that shouldn't be in here. Thing is, I I build my decks based off uh, based off like meta, and like I know I'm never gonna play against these when I'm playing on uh, on uh, fucking Yu-Gi-Oh Pro. <laughs> That's the sad part is I'm building my deck for something I'm literally never gonna play against uh, playing on Yu-Gi-Oh Pro because people don't try as hard as I do. Did you guys know that if you have Amazon Prime? And which I can tell because you have a Twitch Prime icon next to your name. If you wanted to support me, you could sub for free for a month with your Twitch Prime. <laughs> okay, this is one of those situations where duality is really fucking good. My hand is AIDS! Um, mm. uh, I want the Steeds for a specific reason. Um, I'm going to normal summon Winda and I'm going to set Steeds, set Ambush. Because then when Winda dies, I can do my thing. Thoughts on late Zexel? I love late Zexel. Zexel 2 is great. I don't like how they randomly were like, everyone can see Astral now. Because that was like a huge thing in Season 1. Of like, nobody could see Astral. Um, but then just like, Season 2 comes, it's like, oh, we can all see him now. He's there. There he is. And it's like, what? How and why? <laughs> Late Zexel is so awesome. Like, all the way to the point where it's like Shark having his fucking crisis of like, I need to figure out what I am. To the point where it's just like, he goes being, to where he ends up being the ultimate villain. Or not the ultimate villain, but like the final villain, the final bad guy. That's perfect. Um, like, that's perfect to me. Um, I'm gonna let this die. You, you think you're outplaying me, but you're really not. I'm just going to summon the fucking Conahawk out of my deck, and you're just going to be like, what, mate? Yeah, uh, Vrains is 40, is 40 episodes in, and four of those episodes have been recaps. <laughs> it's just way too late to start building things. Um, but, uh, so we'll do this. We'll normal summon uh, Laura. Oh my god, really? <laughs> sure. Sure, mate. I I should have activated Conhawk first. Slight misplay, but it's alright. It works. You know, I I I'd be happy that CXCs at least exist in the card game instead of Dark Synchro literally never happening. Because like we got three dark synchros, and they were just turn they were just retrained into regular synchros that required a dark attribute tuner. It's like what? Like are you what? Why are you? All right, big boy. I need to teach you a lesson. A lesson in how to deal. All right. Well, it looks like I'm using this ambush. Uh, so we'll summon this, and we'll summon Rampanga. Why did I summon it from my vantage zone? I'm fucking dumb, is why. Don't answer that question. Because I already know the answer. So we'll do this. Send this. Uh, so now I can use these two to make um, to make the, the link. Yeah. So I'll just do that. These two to make the link. Uh, effect. Uh, banishing Conahawk. To normal summon this. Then use its effect to get back a Paleo. Which will then banish Winda. I have no idea what cards I've summoned this turn and what cards I haven't. Everything's all over the place. God help me. Okay, can't tag out yet. Cool. Um, I'll just keep checking. Um, this and this into this. Uh, activate. Oh, I can tag out now. Perfect. All right. So we'll put this and we'll put... Uh, what, what's one of the ones I can tag out into? Obviously it's this one. Uh, so we'll, ta we'll chain this, this one, and the window! Ah! Okay, perfect. 
Perfekt. 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 Uh, uh. Uh, okay, so we'll get this. Uh, so now I can just uh, make these into another doodad man. Get another search for another steeds. Perfection. So this will put this engrave and this engrave to search for another steeds. So I've got steed steeds ambush. Boink man. Boink man. Boink man. This dinosaur deck doesn't seem that amazing. People were telling me to play dinos. They're really cool. And this man opened the one miscellaneous Taurus, and he has not used it. Thoughts on Zone's backstory? Uh, I wish that he was actually just Yusei. Would have been a lot more dynamic for the series. Would have been a lot greater. So he was literally Yusei without them just saying, oh, I'm Yusei. Like, his DNA was identical, or else he couldn't have suicided into the fucking reactor. Like... There is no way that you can tell me that man wasn't just Yusei. But he actually was just like, they just they did everything in their power to be like, no, this man isn't Yusei. Um. 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 Okay, so here's the play. Is what I'm going to do is I'm going to go chain link one effect, target these, and then chain link two steeds. On this, because that means that forces him to be chain link three for that, but he can't because there's nothing that he can flip face down. So there's literally no effect he can use. Sometimes that hurts being so next nice level. Sometimes it hurts. I have to go to the bathroom, like really badly. <laughs> I'm like about to piss myself. <laughs> in case you can't tell from me, literally just rolling around in my chair. <laughs> like I am actually about to piss myself. Um. Uh, fuck. What do I put in? Um, I guess Ogre is uh, a good enough swap for just Ash. Um, this sucks going second against it. Uh, I'll take out a Torrential, I guess. Yes. Do I play other card games besides Yu Gi Oh! and MTG? I'm interested in Dragon Ball Super. I've played a little bit of it. Um, but as far as other card games, no. Other games, yes. I play a lot of like strategy games and shit, and like I'm really big. I'm really big fan of like city builders. Like I really love city skylines. Like I've clocked so many hours, like hundreds of hours into city skylines. Um, and like other games, like when Subnautica came out, I was like, cool. Um, normal. How would you open the one up twice? Amazing. Amazing duels. Amazing plays. Normal. I'll just dark hold this. Just so I can get that quick damage, yeah. Do I still play Magic? No, I sold out of Magic like a year ago at this point. Um, I still keep up with it. I've got friends that play. Uh, and sometimes I'll like go to their uh, locals and like they'll hand me a deck and I'll play. Like a couple friendlies, but as far as actually playing the game, nah. I'm just like, eh. Um, and on honestly, they really fucked up Standard, so I don't think I'd get back into the game right now. Like, I I'm not that big a fan of Modern. Um, like, I really like Standard because I really like the concept of set rotation. I feel like set rotation is a great way to balance a card game. Uh, but over the past, like, nine months, they've just been releasing a lot of really questionable cards. It's like they stopped listening to R&D. Um, about, like, what was, like, play, like, what was good and what was healthy. Because they just started, they, they literally took, like, Standard, Magic Standard, and they put just a bunch of cards in. They were just like, we'll just see how this works. Right? And it turned into Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> like, they turned the game into Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, what are you banishing from your hand? Oh, you banished that. Uh, oh, well. Duelists. Um, <laughs> well, <laughs> this is fucking caveman Yu-Gi-Oh, simple as fuck. All right, man, leave it to go, Onizaka or Onizuka, whatever the fuck his name is. Leave it to him to make fucking. 
Gozukis look like an actual good deck. Like, for real. Like, wait, I can summon another window with this, can't I? I can. I'll summon another window. Thank you. Um, like, he literally just turbos out Goki Monsters, and I was like, shit, the deck in the real card game can't do that. <laughs> that deck sucks in regular TCG. Um, but this man's like, I have to summon four Link Monsters? Okay, I will. Like, huh? Not like this. <laughs> Did you really just summon a Dogaran? Oh, your deck's so fucking... You don't even want to kill the window. Don't even want me to float again. Poor bastard. Now I'm the Elder. Now nobody is safe. Um. But Gogenzaka fucking sucked. He was such a shitty character. With a, such a shitty deck. He was like, my deck has no spells. They should have given that man Light Aseka. He needed it. He needed that card. He needed that card so badly. That card should have existed four years ago. For my man, Gogenzaka. Uh, let's see. Uh, these two. Gong Strong. <laughs> yes. Wait. The fuck am I doing? Oh, wait, yeah, I'm doing the regular play. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> that does nothing. Does nothing. Your cards have no effects. You weenie duelist, weenie boy. The strongest gong. The go the strongest gong. The biggest dong. What? Um. So now, now my fair dueling friends, I'm going to tag this two into this. Ah 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 ah. And activate this. Ah, 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 ah. Put this back. And these. And then we're going to. Wait. I didn't. What? Oh, it's in the graveyard. Why am I so fucking dumb? Here's the question. For the ages. The age old question. Why am I so fucking dumb? Um, there's only one card here. There's only one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Well, good thing that I have two steeds. <laughs> Alright. Past turn. <laughs> ah! Oh. <laughs> yeah, fucking hell, we're steezing that. I need to normal summon this a paleo next turn so that I can fucking make it live again. The other summoning types being in, five, in Arc 5 was the best fucking thing about it. Literally the best thing. You could be... Random person appears out of thin air. What are they playing? Fuse? What are they playing? What you playing, big boy? Like, you have access to everything. It was so good. But then it just evolved into Yuya Pendulum Summons until they die. Great. And so now the video's over, I'd like to give special thanks to my patrons, Iradium, Yuki Phoenix, Troy Perkins, Eric Gertson, Tour Guides Guy, and Ringleader, as well as everybody else that's supporting the lower tiers. You guys are forever awesome for the support that you give, you help make things on this channel possible, and I cannot express the amount of appreciation I have for you guys. You guys are awesome, thank you so much for the support.